Well, I'm glad you all could be here to commemorate the worst day of my life. No, I thought the worst day was when you didn't get pulled on stage at that Spin Doctors concert. Or when yeah. your mom substitute taught our sex ed class. Oh, uh, what about that day we made you stop wearing your visor upside down? <laughs> oh, yeah. I thought the worst day of your life was the day you got that haircut that you currently have right now. <laughs> Remember that time when I got my shirt caught? <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Why am I participating in this? Who wants an oyster? Me! No, no, none for me. I am extremely allergic to shellfish. Oh, uh, yes. She gets all pukey and twitchy, and then I gotta take care of her all night, which I find very <laughs> rewarding. Wait, 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 keep him uh, away from Dave also, because yeah. he's super allergic. Yeah, super allergic. Actually, why didn't you get these pre-shucked? This is so much work. Penny, you're sweet, but so, so dumb. So you want to eat your oysters as soon as they've been shucked. It's true. Now, when shucking an oyster, you really want to make sure that you get in there. Now, these oysters are from the northern part of Oregon. <laughs> ah! Trust me, you will feel better. Okay. Um, I never really liked your goatee. Oh. Didn't, was not really aware of that. Um, okay. Uh, I don't really love your favorite perfume. I hate your mom. Oh! Uh, hey, what? Oh. <laughs> I think that's a no. good start for no, today. No, no, no. She wants to play. I can play. Right. I'm not really afraid of dogs. I was just afraid of what would happen to a dog if you owned one. <laughs> Okay, you know those stupid webbed barefoot running socks? They weren't bad for your calves. They were bad for my ability to want to have sex with you. Oh! <laughs> Do you know your friend Glazer? He didn't actually steal my bra and sell it on Craigslist. I just couldn't spend another Sunday watching you two play frolf. Frolf. Frisbee, Frisbee golf. golf. Okay, you know that thing under your mantle that I told you was a tiny brick closet? It's actually a working fireplace. I was afraid you were gonna burn the building down. Okay, well, I hated that song you wrote for me. Love to the power of love. You said it made you cry. It was 12 minutes long. Oh, and terrible. Oh, you wanna know terrible? Yeah. That stupid hula hoop dance that you do. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, this one here. Well, I take the hula hoop and I put it on and I do this, and I shake it, shake it, Still shake terrible. it, bring it up on the neck. Look, I take it to the neck. Hey, you don't let's, like this. Let's you don't like it on this. You don't let's like this? Hoop it on. Love, times love, divided by love. Everyone's having a great time. Love. What is wrong with people? This song is so sad. The square root of love is love. Hey, Dave, this one's on me. Oh! Hey! That waitress looks like she wants a piece of your downstairs goatee. Could be a good way to get out of your dry spell, man. Guys, I'm not having a dry spell. I'm just taking a break. A break from what? Women being attracted to you? No, I just, <laughs> I'm not thinking about dating, you know? I'm focusing on work. The work of being sexually unsatisfied. Okay, right. <laughs> that one was a little forced. Maybe you should force yourself on a girl. I'm not good at these games. If someone's got food on their face, you gotta tell them. You have food on your face. Just like that, ma'am. Power through. Don't even think about how it's affecting you. Oh, I have food on my face. Yeah. There's more. I have more? There's more, man. If I get it? You got it. Oh, wait, there's someone on your forehead. Did I get it? Your lobe. My ear? Yeah. Neck. You got it. Yep. Yeah. Great. It wasn't. I just, I didn't want any of you to know because I knew you would all want to meet her. So... So you're not the most welcoming bunch. I'm a special ed teacher, foster dog mom, and in my spare time, I act out the Sunday comics for blind children. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Okay, you and your board need to get a room. A boardroom. Yes. Everything on my board is coming true. That's great. I even ran into Parker getting off the train, and he asked me out. Really? He was there randomly waiting for you. I guess. I don't know. Anyway, he took me to my favorite wine bar for a glass of Pinot, and he's the first guy I've been with in forever who didn't pronounce the T. The universe is making it happen. <laughs> it's not the universe, Penny. It's Jane. <sighs> Jane, the board is working so well. Mm -hmm. Everything is coming true. So I decided to add some new stuff. Oh. 
I want two first class tickets to Greece for this weekend, and I want to gain five pounds of muscle also for this weekend. What? I want to look good for my trip. It's quite a list. Aw, oh, you look tired. Oh my god, you must be the gay guy. Gay guys love me! Don't worry, we won't sleep together. Yes, we will. <laughs> you, me, and Mr. Uh, Jolly I don't like Jolly. The way this deal. <laughs> Please don't do me. Adam ended it with me. Oh, no, I'm so sorry. Who is Adam? I hated that guy. I mean, things were going so well, and then I suggested a couple's costume, and he, like, freaked out. <laughs> yeah, Pen, you know that I am the biggest couple's costume advocate in the world. I mean, you've read my blog. Of course. But you can't throw a couple's costume at a guy after only three weeks. Classic Penny overreach. <laughs> you might as well have just asked them to marry you, you stupid idiot. <laughs> Looks like Bacon finally got its eggs, huh? Oh, come on! Who bacon somebody? I can't believe I got runner-up. I was totally robbed. Yeah, well... What does he have that I don't have? A big, huge... Jane gets crazy competitive about my exes. What? Remember when she found out my high school girlfriend was a magician? Oh, Wait God. a minute, what is that behind your ear? Oh my God, it's a quarter penny of a little something right in your, oh my God, it's another quarter, again, again. Code clearly states, she is my ex. You cannot have sexual relations with that woman. First of all, you're gay. Fine, I guess you wouldn't mind if I started dating Alex. Hmm? <laughs> Good luck with that. Yeah. Good luck with that. Hey, uh, just have, so like a little, it's like an eyelash or something. Max, what are you doing? I... Oh my God, it's just not like she has a penis. Oh dang, okay. Doesn't bother you at all? Still nothing. Yeah, <laughs> what? Is it like a bajillion degrees in here? You know what, Dave? All codes are off! It's a code war! Oh God, turn it off. What's a code war? Oh, it's hell crazy, Randy. Pure and unadulterated hell. Especially when you're dealing with a dirtbag like this that doesn't respect the codes that hold our civilization together. You wanna to know another code this guy doesn't respect? The health code. That's right, CR. This freak likes to prepare all his meat in his underwear. No, 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 that is not true. That is not true. The closer I am to fine. Hey, buddy. Okay, it happened one time. It happened one time. It was summer. The AC broke. The meat was going bad. I knew I had to sell it fast. I was wearing a hairnet. No, I wasn't. Goodbye. Max, what have you done to my shirts? Oh, yeah. No more dress code, bro. Turned all your T's into super deep V's. You're welcome, my man. Seriously, though, this code war between you and Dave, it's out of hand. No, it's not. What are you doing? That's a load-bearing column! I don't care. No more building codes, bro. You live here too! Ha! But your name is on the lease. Ha ha! I forged an addendum with your name on it! Ha ha! You're bluffing! Ha ha! I am bluffing! Don't hit another pillar, please! You just don't understand because you're not guys. This is what we do. We razz each other. I razz him, he razzes me back. I razz him, he razzes me back. I give him a tight home permanent while he's sleeping. He razzes me back. Wait, what now? Temple Grand. It's Pat. Oh. Penny, I don't think I can do this. If you want to get over him, you have to watch. Mm. Mm. I can't look. Come on, be strong. Oh. oh, yeah. I can't do this for you. You're gonna love it. You got to love all of it. That's it. I'm out, crush over. I got it! What could you possibly have up there that you haven't tried on already? You'll see. Okay, you're a crazy lady. Oh my god. You're really gonna wear your wedding dress to a charity event? Yeah, maybe. I don't even understand what you're raising money for. Animals for change? Are you trying to genetically modify animals? Ooh, I want a teacup rhino. Now, animals for change helps to protect endangered species. Except for pandas. They have plenty of money. They are like the breast cancer of animal charities. Okay, so someone else will be crafting your opening remarks. Oh, you guys, what am I gonna wear? This event is stressing me out. Jane, why don't you let me make you a dress? I've been taking fashion design classes online. Are you guys familiar with Tim Gunn? Yeah. Sure. Huge fan. Good, because it's run by his step-second cousin, Nick Gunn, with one N. Tim blocked him from using Make It Work, but he don't own Figure It Out. It's OK. I, I think I'm going to buy something. Yo, son, you ready to take this rock to the hole? What's up, son? I want street on this, son. I swam as a kid. 
Penny, where have you been? I texted you 911 like three times. What? what? What is it? Did you push a Q-tip too far in again? No, way worse. My brother dropped off his kids for the weekend, so him and his homemade ricotta-selling wife can go save their marriage, which, to quote my best man speech, is doomed. So now I'm stuck with these rug rats and their garbage hipster names for like three full days. Hey, Django. Hi, Rope. Uncle Mac didn't mean that. He loves your name. Are we really spreading the ashes of a guy we barely knew? No, this is the dress Alex made for Jane. It had to be destroyed. Mm. We killed him. Okay. You're going to the big walk-in closet in the sky. Say hi to Nemo's mom for me. Oh, this was the dress overloaded with swag. My staples, why feathers, I don't know. Oh. He doesn't know, he doesn't know. Oh. Okay, so come back. Over here. Hey guys. Got the dress I burned. Huh? Wait. Uh, Why?